Hi, this is Magdalena. I want to show you how to add or change your profile picture or banner in your YouTube channel. The easiest way to do it uh, is to use an online tool which is called um, pixlr.com slash editor. It's a great free tool that you can use online. You don't have to download it to your computer. It's totally free. You even don't have to create a username. So let's get into action. Let's close that. We want to we want to open an image which I have on my desktop. Open image. And I'm sorry. I have it in my download documents. It's over here. Alrighty. This is a template which we're going to use for creating um, our banner. I'm going to tell you at the end of this video how you can get uh, this template and work with it. It makes work much easier so you don't have to worry about, uh, you know, figure out all the, all the specifics uh, and get crazy. And so now what I'm going to do, I'm going to open an image that I want to use and it's in my desktop over here okay perfect so first of all um, I know that uh, the biggest image that uh, is going to be showing up is 2560 by 1440 so I need to crop my image to that size so I'm just going to go to crop output size make sure your output size and then 2560 2560 by 14 1440 okay now I can crop my picture and it's going to be this part okay let's make it smaller okay perfect now I'm going to drag, uh, make sure uh, this layer is highlighted, the background of your picture, and now just drag it to the template. Okay, now in order to see what's going on underneath, I'm going to click uh, on this little square on the left bottom corner, and the opacity option shows up. So now I'm just going to do the change the opacity to like really really like you know small and now I can see what's going on between uh, beneath like which part is going to be visible to um to different users on different devices and now if I want to add text I know the text has to be in this area the darkest area to show up on all devices so that's what I'm going to do I'm going to go to A click here, enter my text my countryside oh, maybe just my countryside so I'm just going to make it bold and maybe change the color to maybe to red okay my countryside, great now I can play with it and move it wherever I want and uh, I just uh, you just want to make sure you don't go there or you don't go too much uh, to the right you have to be somewhere over here like in the middle so I want a little bit on the bottom so now that uh, I'm um, safe I'm just going to change the opacity I'm just going to click back on my background change the opacity to 100 and now I know I'm safe so I'm just going to save it in my desktop go to file save and quality you can increase to 100 and change the name uh, Google, oh, I'm sorry you uh, YouTube banner okay I ask you where you want to save it we say, want to save it on the desktop save and alright we are set 
So now we uh, can close this. I don't want to save it and close this one. And another thing we want to do, crop picture for our profile picture. So let's go to file, open image, and I want to use this image. And it has to be square. So again, go to output size and choose, for example, 600 by 600 pixel. Just crop it and enter. And we are done. Go to File, Save, again, give the name and click OK. Perfect. So we are done with editing the pictures. You see how easy it was. Now we're going to go to the YouTube channel and uh, in order to change, uh, to add the background, uh, over here you can see a big button, Add Channel Art, so we're going to click on that. And then you can drag the photo or you can just select it from your computer. Just make sure you're on the upload photos. Select, so where is my banner? Okay, YouTube banner. taking a little bit time. Alrighty, we are done and it shows us how it's going to be looking on the on the desktop, on the TV and on the mobile device. So uh, it looks like everything is great so I'm just going to select it or in case you have some problems you can um, click on the adjust crop and you can see you know you can you can maybe move it a little bit, maybe you can make it, you know, smaller, move it to the side, adjust it. Let's say we want to, you know, let's say, let's say I don't, let's say I don't want the red, uh, the red roofs because, okay, actually I have to have it. So in this case, I'm just going to leave it like this and just crop it. And then just, uh, the job is done in this case. So let's see what happens. Alrighty. So you can see my countryside and the picture is here. So now let's go to profile picture. So let's go click on uh, the icon uh, and we have to change it on the Google Plus. So let's say OK. And again, let's select the picture from my computer. And the picture is over here. And perfect. And again, we can crop again. Uh, I think they want your face to be as, uh, as big as possible. So that's what I'm going to do. And then set as profile photo. And great, we are done. Share, you can share right away. But I don't want to do this because I don't have anyone. So as you see, the profile picture is here. And now when we go to uh, back to YouTube channel and we refresh it, the profile pictures are out there. So you're done. In order to get the template, please uh, Look below, there is a link to my website and a blog post which contains uh, all the steps uh, for this topic. And as well, there is a picture embedded uh, in the blog. You can just basically click on it and drag it to your desktop and then it will be uh, ready to use. So don't forget to subscribe to my channel and as well, please connect with me on Facebook and Google+. Plus and uh, looking forward to the next videos and sharing with you more information. Thank you!